What's up guys, today I'm going to work on my truck. I'm installing some working flashing light. Here it is, this one it is. I'm putting on the grill, like this car, or we can put like this one. I'll put the link down below. If you want this one, get it on. Or I get it for free from AutoZone. If you want it, I have rewards from there, so I use this one, got it. So before you buy, you can test it like this. And this one, the module thing, you need to be waterproof. So I need to, if water touch will be damaged. So I need to find somewhere to put it on. Uh, here's the remote. Some of them, they're different. This one's different too. But this one, you put it on the... Okay, so I now I'm going to need to take the grill off. And then you need this one too. Say it in the manual. You need it. Don't save it. You need this one. Uh, you put it on the red one, and then continue. Thing. So I'll put ten fuse on here. So now let me go and take the grill off. I hope you enjoyed the video. Okay, guys. So here it is. I'm going to put it over here one over here uh, i think i'll put the white one over here and then the yellow one over here same here i think same here hopefully i don't know we'll see about that one later so i'm going to take this one phillips it is it is this one ford uh 2003 ford 250 so different cars different there is this one Philips. I'm going to pour Philips after that. I take there is some clips down here, one down here, one down here, and there's four. So I'm going to turn it off. So I hope you enjoyed this video. All done guys, I just drill it and finish it. Just need to bolt it in. Uh, you can see like this. Uh, maybe I need to replace it. Yep. So one of the the white one, I'm going to bring it down here. And this one it come over here. So change the place. How they do it like that. So let me do that. So I switched it. Here it is. It's better than the old one definitely. So I rebolt it in. now the wire I need to uh, need to be this side or the dry off side. So I need to do that and then that's it. All done. Yeah, this one is this one is to be somewhere safe without the water, so I'm going to cut it around here and that's it. Okay, so I did like this, bolt it in, all of them are the same deal. So now the wire needs to be organized, so I have to do that. Good morning guys, uh, yesterday was raining, today was raining too, now it just started with I was blind to work. So let me do some review over here, I just taped the wires, uh, but I'm going to replace it, I'm going to search from Amazon and then I'm going to buy that, but I'm going to leave it for now. Uh, so I will not replace it very soon but i'm going to do that it's not that much hard to do if i get it i will put the link down below so you don't need to worry where i get it but for now i'm going to do that and for the module if your truck have a battery cover down here there's a cover black cover mine doesn't have it 
but I'm going to put it around here I don't know whether I can get it or not but if your battery have a cover you can put it maybe maybe over here you can just put it on but if you put it on the inside it will be better glue it maybe yeah you can glue it the wires long so you can do that so now I'm going to start before the rain starts I hope you enjoyed the video don't forget to like and subscribe so for the clips it is over here one two and three and four so I need to uh, squeeze it and then pull it from there It'll be inside here over here and here and here but if you don't know if, if you never did it it'll be harder but you will get it how to do it so you don't need to worry so. let me put it on the rain's coming Okay guys, the rain stopped and I was working on the wires. I just put the module inside because I was not uh, sure over here if there is a water or not. And I'm going to take the, from the battery direct wire from here to inside there. If you want to do that, you could, or you can take it from inside. Just test all the wires, which one power, only you need power, ground you can't find anywhere. So I did that. Uh, so this one's the ground from the battery and the power I just send the, the wire in uh, and to fit the wires sometimes can use some longer uh, stronger uh, steel uh, but I have some like this uh, some people doesn't have definitely this one's a little bit expensive to buy but you can use some stick wire stronger just fit it in uh, so if we want that the Milwaukee I will put the link but you don't need it you don't need to work on there uh, and here it is the wire the power and uh, the ground so the ground you can put over here if you want but I just bring both of them in here you can use and to to for the power if you are not bringing a new wire uh, you can test Maybe in there, in there, every car is different, so just test her. You can test by this one, this one over here. You just poke the wire like this, and then one of the, this one you're going to put on the ground, this one you put on the ground, and then this one you just test for the power. Or you can do, if you turn the ignition on, uh, if you want that one, you're going to find it over here, but I don't recommend that one. If you do that one, only if you take the, if you turn only the ignition on, you can get the power. So if you want to do direct or that one, it's your choice. And I'll put the link down below. If I want to use the tools, here it is. Uh, the almost there. I already finished the wiring. So I already clip everything. And then over here, I did the uh, clip it. And then if I want, if the lights have issues, can I can turn off it. I can take it from here and then shut it off. Uh, so here it is, the modules down here. I was planning to put it over there and there, especially there, but the wire, this wire is too small, so I can reach there. So I just leave it there. So I'm going to put this one inside here. And then oh, that's it. So here's the fuse. I need to put this one somewhere. So I will put the link down below every tools I used. So I hope you enjoyed the video. After this, I'm going to test it. I'm going to test now and then later after it's dark outside. So. What's up guys? So I finished wiring up, everything's done. Everything's wired up. Uh, I will finish inside. Now the lights on. You can change any mode you want. So now it's flashing like this. And the inside is all done, wired up, everything's done finish the inside and then for this remote control you can see if the mode uh, over here if I change it it will change too now it's flashing both of them if I change like this it's different slow motion now it is slow motion and go let me show you there too 
I will show you later more uh, after it's dark outside. Just like this. So let me change it one more time and then I'm going to wait after it's darker outside. So here it is. So I'll be back after it's outside dark. Okay guys, outside now is dark, so I'm going to test it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm changing every mode. So this one is different. I think that's it. I don't know how much I did. I show it to you.